Hey folks, uh, Jim, uh, just thought I'd uh, do this video. I was looking over some uh, financial stuff tonight, reading reports and so on and so forth. And something very disturbing and alarming came over. And uh, I don't know if I'm the first one to report this or not. However, the elites are divesting from Taiwan. They're pulling out, okay? And uh, that should concern you all a lot because that means China is going to move on Taiwan. It's pretty much assured. If people start pulling money out of somewhere, those in the loop, if you will, the big money masters, and they start moving their money out of somewhere, and I bet they did it right before Ukraine went too. What do you bet? Right? So here we go. Taiwan, uh, they're divesting of Taiwan and companies are pulling out, okay? So, hey, here's for me to you, because folks, whether we like it or not, the world is about to change. How? I don't know. Is it gonna be all out war? I don't know. Did they plan the strategic changes of Ukraine and possibly Taiwan next to move along the Great Reset? Folks, I don't know. Um, I'm just a, a little guy trying to get through this thing called life. You know what I mean? One day at a time. And uh, so I don't know. But I can tell you this, uh, that they are pulling out of Taiwan. Okay. A lot of money is pulling out of Taiwan. And I don't know if it began today or if it's been slowly happening, okay? So I can't tell you that, I just know what I, what I read, okay? So, I think the world as we know it is going to change very soon. Obviously it is, right? I mean, you see oil, you see the price of food, you see Ukraine and now possibly Taiwan. You're darn right, the world is changing. So I hope you're prepared from me to you. Uh, if you've never had these before, they're zero calorie, no caffeine, um, really uh, simple uh, drinks. This one's grapefruit. That's my favorite. It's simple and whatnot, and I like it. And it gives me a break from water. <laughs> you know, it gives me a little flavor anyway, because I live mostly on water and coffee. But uh, yeah, folks, I think our world as we know it, is going to change for sure over the next uh, couple of months. I mean, let's hope it's not World War III winds up happening, and let's hope for sure that no nuclear weapons go off, and we can all have some form of an assembled life, you know what I mean, that we recognize today. But who knows what can happen? And I'm not trying to be an alarmist here or worry you or panic you or anything like that. I'm just sharing with you the information I just read. And this is by a national, financial, very reputable place, okay? So, uh, I don't know if that news was supposed to be leaked yet or not, but it found its way out there, okay? So, um, just know and be aware of that. Uh, it seems like companies are starting to pull out of Taiwan. And that kind of signals to me that either they're going to let Taiwan fall to China or they know China's coming, uh, pretty much for sure. And this is a chess game going on right now. I hope that this wasn't planned and that Putin and Xi Jinping just saw the weakness uh, in NATO's armor at this particular moment in time and knew that they needed to move now before Europe got independent of Russian oil and gas and went to their green uh, agenda that they were planning on. So maybe Russia made that move now, okay? And maybe that's the precursor to Xi Jinping making his move or their move in Taiwan and so the whole world as we know it, I believe, is going to change one way or another. Either it's going to be war or the face, the landscape of the world, the natural resources, 
that are controlled immensely by these large uh, countries anyway, Russia and China, right? They control a lot of natural resources, folks. They're involved in a lot of it, right? And they've hoarded it for the last, since 2019, Russia and China have both been hoarding food and metals and a lot of other things, okay? So, and that is open information. That is all confirmable, okay? And they also have been preparing for a lot of things, okay? So I think, uh, you know, once Trump left office, they made their plan of how they were going to move. Now, is the whole globe involved with it? I don't know. But I wanted to share that with you tonight. It looks like the financiers are preparing for Taiwan to go next, okay? So... Whatever that means to you, uh, it may mean nothing to you. But to me, it's very concerning that um, they're making these moves. Because when they move, usually something's going to happen, right? They know before all of us. We're just the pawns in their game, right? So, anyway, I thought I'd share that with you. Let it be early. Um, I just happened to be up tonight uh, for some reason. And I just... Got lucky catching that, okay? Because I did not see it on the news at all today. However, it is happening, okay? Global financiers are divesting and getting out of Taiwan. So, be aware of that. Um, I hope you're all doing well. Uh, I did another video. Please like and subscribe. I keep forgetting to say that on the videos. I know I'm a small channel and all of that, but... Please like and subscribe so I can start growing the channel again, if you would, please. Uh, I would be very grateful. Um, we're all in this together. I have a couple of things maybe that might be worth hearing and sharing with the, with the YouTube community. Um, some days I've got something worth listening to anyway. Like today, happening to see that, okay? Happening to see that report that... Money's getting out of Taiwan, okay? So, um, but anyway, yeah, please like, subscribe, uh, you know, share. Please write in, share. Let me know how you're feeling, what you're thinking, uh, what things mean to you. And let me know what kind of things you might like to hear or know about if you don't already know, you know, what you need to know. Um, I, I know a couple of things. And I can share on a few things. And hopefully I can be of use to you and you can be of use to me. And we can share and help each other grow on this journey of being prepared. Because I, my gut's telling me, folks, something's not right, man. I mean, obviously something's not right, right? That's, that's totally obvious. But I think it's way beyond even this Ukraine deal, folks. I think something's really going down. Are they going to do the whole global reset? Or has China and Russia been playing chess while Biden and NATO have been playing checkers? You know what I mean? Or is it the other way around that everybody's being baited into something? I don't know. But I do know that Biden flew to Texas today, so he's pretty desperate. If Biden flew to Texas to make deals with oil producers, he is desperate. And that's very concerning to me, too. And you heard that here. Okay, today, Biden went to Texas today to make some deals with oil producers, okay? And probably develop a plan because they see what's coming. So anyway, I hope you're all doing well. Um, yeah, please again, like and subscribe. And uh, I'll try and get the channel going again. I'll try and do more videos. And please write in, tell me what you want to hear about, what you think you, you know, what maybe I can help you with. There are so many great people out there doing a great job on their channels. I'm just one little guy that wants to uh, share uh, a little bit of information, especially during this time. You know, I stopped making YouTube videos for a long time. I had a lot of other things to do, but I think now it's important. And the more of us that are out there sharing information, you know, not fear and worry and all of that, but trying to share just knowledge and information and help each other get prepared and grow 
and see what's coming. Maybe together we can all put this puzzle together and see exactly what's coming. I don't know, but maybe we can. Hope you're all doing well. Jim out.